Okay, so we're going to need to locate all these switches. And then we'll apparently have to deactivate them all within the span of five minutes. Oh boy. Obviously I went the wrong way here. So let's catch up. Let's check out the uh, this new kitchen area here. By the oven. And I don't see a switch because I don't see a fucking oven. Obviously we have an oven here. I'm going to assume that note was written in the past and thus refers to the old kitchen rather than this new kitchen. So that's where we'll find it. Okay. That time thing is probably not a joke either. Probably got a fucking timer on that shit. And then recite the prayer of the wall builder. I think that's another scroll I have. So. That's a thing. So we'll go down this way. Might as well pick away. I'm not sure whether I'm allowed to be down here at all. I'm going to assume... No. <clears throat> Either I am allowed to be down here. That was fucking lucky. Let's put you here. You go, Napsky. Anything useful? I mean, I didn't see an inverted red hammer, but, uh... You can never tell these fucking hammer heads. <laughs> Sorry, it's pretty musty down here in this crypt. to be here? <clears throat> I am. Good. That was a good time to test it out. Just gotta hope no one finds the bodies. <laughs> Just like in real life. <laughs> Moving on. I'll take that. Like this. Lots of prizes. And as you folks should know by now, big fan of prizes. Okay. Iesu Domine. I just did a fucking loop. <laughs> Okay, I remember this place. Let's try the staircase. Okay, I'm in the basement now. Storage room. I can walk through the barrels. There's a death trap wagon right there. Bunch of hammers. Nothing of value. Okay. I assume the the high priest key is going to open all these doors for me. Hello. Oh, that's what that sound must be. The sound must be me running out of time in that. Fucking what the, the the switches fucking flipping back to their original states. Hey, sweet. I'm glad I solved that mystery. Wonder how many comments I might get at the fucking end of the last video explaining that shit. That does not need to be explained. <laughs> this is what happens whenever you record things in like group sessions. So I'm not allowed to be in here. This is the treasury. Oh, 
You are a delight. So, switch. There's one of the switches. I'll flip it for fun. And we'll test out my theory if we hear the sound happening again. Ah, oh, I'm gonna wish I had a speed potion for this. Perhaps even multiple speed potions. Alright, this is another storage area. The staircase that takes us up. At the uh, location unknown. Huh. Interesting. I'm interested in going to the Inquisitor place, though. They did say one of the, the things was by the rack. Obviously, that's of some concern to me. Nope. This. No. I could probably throw that scroll away, but, uh... Keystone Tree. So I'm probably gonna have to go out to that fucking garden with all those goddamn trees. Just go ahead and take care of your ass. So you don't come back to fucking bite me in the ass. Mr. Inquisitor, sir. Yeah, uh, yeah, we've seen that one before. Inquisitor's got a stack of cash. Inquisitor's got a fucking hammer. Oh. Oh. Oh, you got the slanted floor with the, the fluid drain and everything. Ooh. Okay, there that is. Clever hammerites. You crafty bastards. Where the hell does this take me? Dora, 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 the explorer. Here where I knocked a dude out. Now where we, what we actually need to do is we actually need to find the place that all these switches will reveal where the talisman fucking is. I need to find where the fucking talisman is. I think I found it! Okay! I guess flipping the switches will create a bridge over troubled water which will lay me down. Got it. Good discovery, everyone. I'm glad we had that moment together. So, how do I get up there? where I assume a bridge would be unleashed. How the fuck do I get up here? Rope arrow? Rope arrow! Fuck, I don't have any. God damn it. The one fucking time. Well, not the one time. God damn rope arrow. That would be useful there, huh? Alright. So... Okay. Get out of this kooky place. I need to find a way to where that is. Because that's important. I need to find a way to get there. Okay, it's the staircase. I'm still in location unknown though, so I assume that somewhere in here is that way. Yeah, and uh, this map was one that was part of the Thief the Dark project. There used to be two talismans kept here, so I assume that other spot is for the other talisman. Okay! Now let me go find that switch by the fucking tree. Let me make sure I got the layout of this place fucking good. Alright, alright. I'll wait for those switches to do their pew power down thing. I've taken care of most, if not all, of the hammerheads. Which
which is nice. Right, going to the garden. That's down here. Keystone tree. Wait for that shit to power down. I don't think I got every single thing I could have. I do have 2400 in loot though. That's all I fucking need. Alright, there went the power down. I don't know whether there'll be a separate power down or not though, because of the other switch I flipped. The one with the rack. Because I did flip that. Alright, whatever. We'll find out. begin. With this, I gotta hurry on over to Brother Mason. Don't forget the skull of St. Yora either, Grimmoth. No. God damn it. There we go. There's that. Need to run up. Ideally, you know, this would be the first one I'd get, the skull one. Ah. Okay. Now I need to go back down. That's three that I've just flipped. Need to go into the basement. I need to get the one in the kitchen, and then I need to get the one by the inquisit, uh, by the rack. Assuming that one didn't stay down, which I'm gonna go ahead and assume that it didn't. Fuck. I'm getting turned around a bit here. And in here. Here we go. Oh, someone powered up. <laughs> Alright, let me find the way out of here, Mr. Wizard. Nope, I want the staircase up. Oh, shit. Oh god. Oh god. Getting lost. Getting fucking confused. One fucking panic. Here we go. This is what I wanted. Yep. Uh, yeah. Then he who removes the uh, what? Did I not do it fast enough? Did I do it wrong? Uh. Uh. Fuck! I thought I had that shit. Did I flip this switch by the fucking Inquisitor? Did that fucking unflip itself? No. I must have not just done it fast enough. Heh. <laughs> I flipped all five. Keystone Tree, Brother Mason, Skull of St. Yora. And that does say off, right? Alright, I'll fucking solve this. Let's flip them all back on. Maybe due to... something or another. I fucked up. This will help me learn the layout of this map better, in theory. <laughs> in theory. In practice, I'm not so sure. The 
kitchen's on the other side. Let's go ahead and flip that off. Alright, we'll try that again, and if that doesn't work, we can go back on. You know, there was a great sound that was made, which seemed to indicate victory. Yet, whenever I tried to cross, it did not yield victory. Maybe it realizes the fact that I'm not a true believer. It has thus shunned me. Alright, retrace the footsteps. We'll start at the top, we'll go with St. Yora, and then we'll work our way back down. I would apologize, but you have a YouTube timeline you can use to skip things. I don't. On, and now finally, the skull of Saint Yora. Mm. So I flipped all these things back on there. Interesting. I assume you're on now? I can't quite fucking read that. I have to assume you're in the right position. Okay! I don't know if I should give it some time, wait a fucking minute, have a goddamn ham sandwich. How the fuck are you all doing? Group in the air. Huh? Let me... Let me make sure I got this all right. Yes, yes, I assume I need to read you. Yeah, you're that. I don't really need you, but I'm still carrying you around. The cage containing the talisman can only be opened when the five locks have been released. The lock releases are placed in various locations about the temple. When all the locks are released, the talisman cage can be opened. There wasn't a bridge, though. What if there was, like, a separate... Fucking switch to like the left of the door I didn't notice that would activate the fucking bridge. I just fucking thought of that. And that thought just goddamn pissed me off. Like that lock might not even re-engage even though I've set everything to on due to how the uh maybe how event switches work in this game. Maybe I uh I fucking failed to notice something. I wouldn't put it past me. Kermit has failed to notice plenty of things in the past. There's a switch. Do I just jump? <sighs> ha. Well, I feel a little silly now. <laughs> Is it the scroll? No. It was the papyrus. I am a wall builder. Let my walls endure from season to season. Year to year and age to age. Let my walls stand while families toil. Armies march and empires fall. I'm a wall builder. My walls will stand always as a shield against evil. This I pray that will the master will grant. Can you stand closer? Ah. There we go. And I hurt myself a little bit. I did activate alarm. Apparently you're supposed to fucking jump. Because, uh, either that or there's some sort of bridge command or console. I didn't even think of trying to make the jump. I guess if you have a rope arrow, you can just fucking... Well, that's in the way. Also, this has activated the alarm. I missed that jump, and you know what? I can't be asked. I think I knocked all these sons of bitches unconscious if I didn't know well. I feel like I got most of, if not all, of the loot. If I didn't, oh well. I still haven't learned the layout of this fucking place. Oh well. <laughs> there we go. There's my staircase up. Someone took the talisman! 
Fuck. Ah, this wasn't a bad map either. I did fairly well. Obviously had a few problems. I did quick load a lot. That there confused me a little bit. I thought a bridge would be made. I didn't think I'd have to make that jump. But I did. Well, I probably didn't have to. I just didn't think of a way to make a bridge. Or find a rope arrow or something. Ah, uh, not bad. I missed uh, maybe one piece or maybe a few other little pieces. I think I'll get over it. That was a pretty easy map. Obviously, it did load a bunch of times, but eh, I I guess I can see why they might want to lengthen that uh, and take uh, one of the talismans and make it its entirely separate map. The Opera House map is pretty fucking long in comparison. It's also a lot fucking fun. Uh, this one wasn't so bad, though. I don't mind having continued the session. So, we have all four talismans now. Which I assume means next time, we'd actually try to retrieve the eye. It's probably not going to be as easy as advertised. You know, some people might have gotten suspicious by, or, you know, alarmed by us taking all these talismans. Is this a pretty, it seems like a pretty big fucking deal, these talismans. To release an even bigger deal, an eye. In exchange for a theoretical payment from an old man with incredible power who doesn't seem trustworthy at all. <laughs> Again, I'm just saying, I know Garrett got his metal eye sometime in this game. This shit doesn't seem kosher. Take care, everyone. Talk to you later.